No, don't come in. Father, mother, unborn son. Oh, I'm hoping for a son. Plenty of time for daughters later. How could you possibly know? I'm familiar with the condition, and I've had my eye on you. Your waist, it's tiny as ever, though, a bit queasy here and there, no? Also, a few weeks ago, I had your chamber pot tested. Oh, it's the usual exam. It's horse urine and wine. It's very reliable. And yesterday, one of my ladies, she was very touched by your rather joyous embrace at the water's edge. You've been having your spies follow us. I was being discreet. I was waiting to let you be the one to tell Francis. Francis! Mother, I thought that we might keep it a secret for now. Nonsense! This child strengthens Mary's position as an heir-producing Catholic, which in turn strengthens her claim, France's claim to the throne, English throne. As long as that Protestant Elizabeth remains barren and unmarried, you are a better option. Enter! Uh. Ah. Skin tonics from Cairo. And food to help aid in the baby's development. And sage to ward off restless spirits. There are many in the castle after the plague. Pregnant women are particularly vulnerable. Tell me again how happy you are. I don't think I have ever been this happy. <laughs> Your figure's gonna go to hell anyway, so you might as well eat up. You are feeding the future king of France. <laughs> 